moment of truth, and there's no going back. Went from Bonnie and Clyde to Jekyll and Hyde. We're fire and ice. We're fire and ice. They've got the flag up now, and you can see the stars and stripes on the left. Are you seeing a TV picture if you want to let the world know you started the business or make a statement about the territory you've claimed, you should plant a flag. Flags have been used for centuries as a visual claim to territory and power. Each and every one of them has a special meaning expressed through any combination of symbols and colours imaginable. Most countries take immense pride in their billowing. On the other hand, quite a few cities, companies and even families will be hard-pressed to explain their flag, if they even remember they have one. But not all flags are made with the same care and craftsmanship. In fact, it is quite hard to find a company that doesn't just print the patterns onto the fabric. Sewing isn't as popular as it used to be. Did you know that the flags that adorn the White House were made in the little Flemish town of Osterosebeke? That means that every time President Obama lays his hand over his heart, he proudly pledges allegiance to the United States and to the Walkins family business. But not all their products are being exported. Once every six years, the Walkins company makes the sashes of the city councils for almost the entire country. They have been doing so since 1926, when the company was founded. One sash takes them half an hour and is completely made by hand, tassels and all. So just imagine the distance you could cover if you tied hundreds of these together. So, when you win at poker, playing cards from Turnout, you can buy your own island constructed by Jan de Nul and give it its own Balkans flag.